Hey guys, Kevin Stark here with the market update. We are seeing rapid changes and fast. Let me outline what's going on. We got the Cromford Market Index up here, which again is an algorithm that puts all the data, data tracked daily on the real estate market into an algorithm as kind of a precursor of where things are headed as of today. It's a daily tracker, okay? Above 100, seller's market. Supplies down here, demands up here. Below 100, buyer's market. Supplies up here, demands down here. Okay, so seller's market, sellers have the advantage. We're seeing it plummet this year. Uh, here's for right now, here's where we are 2022. This is more of a normal market for a perspective. 2015 to 2019 was more one of the most normal markets we've had in 20 years. This was the crash of 2005. This is when the financial markets crashed and sank. So if we're looking for normality, that's kind of where it's been tracked in the last 20 years. We're up here, falling faster than ever before, but still normality's right here. Okay, so just to give a perspective is yes, everybody's screaming, the sky's falling, but my argument would be looking at the graph compared to normal, this was never a realistic market. You can't have appreciation like that and be consistent in any market. So we'll continue to watch this, not saying things can't continue to go down further, but again, financial markets are stable today. This was not stable, right? The banking system crashed. Everybody that got mortgages that should have got mortgages, got mortgages, right? People are getting qualified, are qualified to buy today or buying with cash. So financing is still solid in this area, but appreciation could never stay there. I hope this is helpful. Let me know questions on your area. Again, rapid changes. We'll keep you updated. God bless.